right, welcome back, everyone. We're back with episode seven of season four, Game of Thrones. So we just came off the trial of Tyrion Lannister. Man, does that mean we almost done with season four? Yeah, we got four more episodes. Oh, wow. We're flying through it. <laughs> so the trial did not go well for Tyrion. They had everybody that you could possibly think of testify against them. Even, even but did, her Shay. Even Shay. So he in the end he decided to quest the trial by combat. Which we'll see how that goes for him. And um Theon Greyjoy? Yeah. Yara, at, his at, sister, tried to save him. Try to save him, but he didn't want to go. He, he brainwashed. He, he he brainwashed him. Yeah, he, he like this is a guy. trick. He probably didn't realize it was her because he's so brainwashed. And every time he tried to escape her, you know, somebody try to help him out, he get mutilated or beaten or, you know, something. So now the little uh, bastard, because that's what he is, a bastard. Ramsey. Um, Yeah. He wants Greyjoy to pretend like he's him because right now his name is Reek. Which apparently is because he reeks up piss and poop. That's what John said. Yeah. yeah so so I ain't catch that, but hey, he did. Yeah, it's been calling him Reek. And he like, look a little bit like, like a little skid. Look, look like a little skid. That's a good yeah. name for you. So uh, we're going to see how that, I, I would like to see how that storyline turns out because Great Joy always betrayed somebody. You know, he's a he's a traitor. So, proven it time and time again. Yeah, and he's a downright traitor. And then Stannis went over to Bravos to visit the Iron Bank and got a got a loan. Apparently, yes. Apparently, he uh, what's his name? Davos. Davos convinced, convinced him, to give him, him to give him some money. So, and how would you know? How would was that? Lannister, Ty, Tywin. Tywin Lannister feel about that. You gave him gold, but y'all ran out of gold uh, over there. You know what I'm saying? It's, so it's, it's what they got the Tyrells on the side to try to get their money. So uh, apparently, you know, I would like to see how all this unfolds. Not apparently, but I would love to see how all this unfolds. So, uh, you're gonna see how it unfolds. We're gonna get through all the season. And me, I say, <laughs> um, Tyrion should pick Prince Oberyn, 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 to be his warrior and trial by combat. I'm just saying, you know, do some give somebody for him to kill. You know, hopefully, they pick his daddy to you know go against the person. Tower ain't gonna fight nobody. So then he had, you know, Prince Obron, Obron, Obron will knock out two birds with one stone. I'm you know, just I saying. guarantee you, Tywin, he ain't going to fight nobody in a trial by combat. Because Tywin ain't going to risk his life mm-hmm. to kill Tyrion or to save Tyrion. And Tywin is all about Tywin. Mm-hmm. And Lannister name. Yeah. He's all about Lannister name. Okay. Let's well, get started. Well, let's get on with it and see what happens in this episode. Exciting. One oath returned to Star Coast to their mother. There's still a chance to find Sansa. I'm getting married to your Aunt Lysa. She's waiting for us at the Eyrie. Peter is risking his life to save you. What have you let Peter do with your body? He loves you, Aunt Lysa. I swear it. I will not let those I have freed slide back into chains. Sandor Clegane slaughtered five of our soldiers. What would it take to make the common soldier try his luck with the hound? What do you want? Here he go. And I'll shove that stick up your bungalow. Tyrion of the House Lannister. Stand accused by the Queen Regent of Regicide. You'll take my place as your son and heir if you let Tyrion live. So she's still the Queen because he just said you accused and accused by Queen of the Regent. Queen of the Regent. I demand a trial by combat. I think we she was a Queen was not current Queen. I don't know what Regent means. I have to look that up. Yeah. 
still burning. They were going to put that fire out? <laughs> still burning. That's a long way. I'm just saying. Looking at the map. <laughs> yeah. You can fly over there to, uh, to Brazos and take out that gold and stuff. <laughs> you should be the richest person. And everybody will have to come up. You know what I'm saying? I guess they ain't got no slaves there. I made a deal for you. To keep your ungrateful head on your ungrateful neck a little while longer. I'm sorry, what am I grateful for? You threw your life away. You threw it away. It's not a joke. You understand that, don't you? Of course it's a joke. Just not a very funny one. <laughs> I couldn't listen to her standing there telling her lies. You fell in love with a whore. Yes. <laughs> that deal you made, it was everything Father wanted. He gets you back as his heir. It felt good to take that from him. He knows I'm innocent, and he's willing to sacrifice me anyway. He's willing to sacrifice any of us. Not you! You're the golden son! You could kill a king, lose a hand, so you'll always be the golden son. Careful. <laughs> I'm the last friend you've got. <laughs> At least I got to tell them what they really are. Yes, brilliant speech. They'll be talking about it for days to come. <laughs> Don't give up on me just yet. I survived one trial by combat, even though you weren't there to save me. Where's your sense of adventure? Mm. Even if you lose, imagine the look on Father's face when you fall. <laughs> Our family name snuffed out with a single swing of the sword. <laughs> She'd get Jamie to do it. Tywin would never let anybody kill Jamie. Yeah. So then Jamie would win, and then Tywin and then Tyrion would go free. Cersei might have somebody kill Jamie to get. Frickin' Tyrion, her crazy ass. Yeah. Who does Cersei plan on naming as a champion? I hope it's Samarin Shant. Mm. No. Ooh. Not Samarin. Now that ain't fair. I'm, I'm like, that ain't fair. <laughs> oh my god. This <laughs> shit. Eat it. Mercy. <laughs> you say you cry. Mm, mm, mm. Welcome to the capital. Thank you for riding here so quickly. You seem to be in good form. Who am I fighting? Does it matter? Mm -mm. You shouldn't be sitting out here like this. Where else to sit? Tried to walk back to me hut. Had too much. Then I remember they burnt me hut down. That's not going to get better. Doesn't seem so. You better not kill him. So why go on? Habit. Nothing could be worse than this. You were a father. A captor. Now I know you know. The whole world know. Can I have a drink? Dying is thirsty work. <laughs> he said dying is thirsty work. Yeah. Wish you were wine. So do I. <laughs> they gonna wish you were... Did he kill him? Yeah. Look, I had to look <laughs> Did he say, wish you well? He said, wish it were wine. Oh. And he said, so do I. Then he stabbed him. Why? I mean. That's where the heart. There ain't no horse. You gotta put down. Put him out of misery. Well, down of a. Oh? Down of a abdomen wound is not a very good way to go. The fuck are you doing? Oh. Yes, that's what the king does when you tell him to fuck off. The king's dead. The bounty on you is for killing Lannister soldiers. A hundred silver stakes. And you thought you were going to collect it. You were Yoren's prisoners when he was taking me to the wall. He on your little list. He can't be. I don't know his name. What's your name? Rouge. Thank you. <laughs> you just gonna sit there? <laughs> Hell, you're learning. <laughs> They make a good little pair. Yeah. <laughs> Rangers return a greetings. He was hoping he'd die, huh? Yeah. Lord Snow, this is no place for wild beasts. Shut up. Why? Because he'll go after you? <laughs> Come on, ghost. Muncie's army was closing in on Craster's Keep when we left. They'll reach the wall before the next full moon. So we need to prepare. We've been preparing. We should seal the tunnel. We can't defend the gate against 100,000 men. 
Have you ever seen a giant, Sir Alistair? No, because he ain't been in battle. <laughs> the bars on those gates are four inches thick. Cold rolled steel. And they won't stop them. First builder, Yahweh. Lord Snow here recommends sealing the tunnel. Do you agree with him? No. Hmm. Look like he did. Moving on. First builder will need a hundred barrels of pitch before the top of the wall. I just want him to just flip him over the wall. You know, just flip him over the wall. And where the blind man at? Oh. He got more pull than they do. Right? Where he at? Y'all fancy up. My lord. Hmm. You have new clothes sent for you days ago. I've been a bit busy. Doing what? My yes. lonesome bachelor days are over. I'm to wed Lollis Stokeworth. She doesn't strike me as your sort of girl. She's dim-witted. If I wanted wits, I'd marry you. Mm -hmm. You and my sister deserve each other. Why did you bother to come here? You once said, if anyone ever asked me to sell you out, you'd double their price. Is it two wives you want, all two castles? One of each you do. Mm -hmm. If you want me to kill the mountain for you, it better be a damn big castle. I'm a bit short on costs at the moment, but I can offer you gold in gratitude. My wife is heir to Winterfell. I guess she is, huh? That's her daddy dead, her brother dead. Well, Brent. Brent is really, but they don't know he's alive. Does he frighten you so much? I'd be a bloody fool if he didn't frighten me. He's freakish big and freakish strong. And quicker than you'd expect for a man of that size. Hmm. Maybe I could take him. Dance around until he's so tired of hacking at me, he dropped his sword. Get him off his feet somehow. But one misstep, and I'm dead. Why should I risk it? Hmm. You're my friend. Aye, I'm your friend. And when have you ever risked your life for me? Hmm. Wow. Well, if you put it like that... Well, what the hell is he gonna do? He can't kill nobody. Uh, well, that's a, that's a perspective you gotta do. I'm sorry it has to be this way. Why are you sorry? Because you're an evil bastard with no conscience and no heart? That's what I like. Oh, he probably told about Shay. Probably. That's probably why he got all the fancy clothes and a new wife yeah. in the castle. We had some good days together. Yes, we did. <laughs> he gonna let me go. He's not a very good friend. What will you do? I suppose I'll have to kill the mountain myself. Won't that make a great song? Oh, they killed your life. I hope to hear them singing. Going down slingshots. Yeah, right? Rub two knots. Oh. <laughs> Alright, call for her. Let the dragon fight for me. There you go. I'm good. Forgive me, my queen. I, I live to serve you. <laughs> Tell me why you're here. Came to ask a favor. Here in Marine, I cannot pursue my talents. I've ordered the Second Sons to patrol the streets to stop the revenge killing. You've ordered us to be night. And patrol. as for women, there are thousands in Marine you can pursue. There's only one, and she does not want me. Send me to kill your enemies. Let me do what I do best. Hmm. Very well. Go at the Stannis. There you go. And the Red Witch. He took my witch talent up. <laughs> Take off your clothes. I, look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's name gonna get? Pissed and jealous. She said, take off your clothes. Look at her. I'm like, Lord Jesus. She's just staring pretty hard, huh? <laughs> Come in, my queen. Please. I didn't mean to disturb you, my lady. You could never disturb me. I just wanted to speak with you before we left. When I looked into the flames this morning, the Lord spoke to me. Say so <laughs> Tonight, you will have your last good bath in a long while. Okay. A joke. Not a very good one, I'm afraid. It was. I humor isn't my strength. I did beauty. I'm just sorry. I'm just sorry. <laughs> Be honest, right? He wants to bring Shireen with us. I think that would be ill advised. She should stay home. I understand how you feel. Hmm. That is impossible. Why? 
When we set sail, your daughter must be with us. The Lord needs her. Jorah the Andal. Are you here to see our queen? She's in a good mood. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Khaleesi. You're here early. Later than some. <laughs> you don't approve. It's not a question of approval, it's a question of trust. Dario Naharis killed his captains and dumped their heads at your feet when he grew tired of their commands. How could you ever have faith in a man like that? I could never have faith in a man like Dario. That's why I've sent him and the second sons to retake Yunkai. The masters tear babies from their mother's arms. They mutilate little boys by the thousands. They train little girls in the art of pleasuring old men. They treat men like beasts. The slaves you freed, brutality is all they've ever known. If you want them to know something else, you'll have to show it to them. I can end it. I will end it. And I will end those behind it. I sold men into slavery, Khaleesi. I wouldn't be here to help you if Ned Stark had done to me what you want to do to the masters of Yunkai. The man who came to me the other day about burying his father. His Darzol Lorak. He will accompany the Second Sons and serve as my ambassador to Yunkai. He will explain the choice they have before them. They can live in my new world or they can die in their old one. Mm. Oh, Lord. <laughs> You're doing it wrong. You need to burn away that horrible bit there. Otherwise, it's going to get infected and fester. Yeah. There you go. No fire. It'll only take a second. It won't hurt that much. No fire! <laughs> Never get infected and die. Thanks to you, I'm a walking bag of silver anywhere the Lannisters hold sway, which is everywhere between where we are now and where we're going. No rewards worth this much trouble. <laughs> you say your brother gave you that sword. My brother gave me this. Pressed me to the fire like I was a nice juicy mutton chop. Why? I thought I stole one of his toys. I didn't steal it. I was just playing with it. <laughs> the pain was bad. The smell was worse. But the worst thing was that it was my brother who did it. And my father who protected him. Told everyone my bedding caught fire. Hmm. Let me wash it out and help you sew it up at least. I don't want no good washing. I mean, I need... <laughs> I know she ain't all nervous, but... Can I get you anything else? Mm -hmm. No, this will do nicely, thank you. Kidney pie is wonderful. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Oh, that's what's the pie. About the ingredients. Flour, lard, water, eggs, milk. But like, who told you to sit down? I'm over. <laughs> Good bottom round steak and calves kidneys is not easy. Oh, and the gravy. Don't get me started on the gravy. Very difficult to get right. But like, I do. <laughs> like, do you ever sit up? You a knight? No. What brings you to these parts? We're looking for someone. Someone in particular? Maybe they came in here. I mean, just the other day we had 17 A girl, high. tall, red hair, very pretty. Her name is Sansa Stark, but she may be using a different name. Starks? No, I ain't seen anyone like that. Oh, there was all traitors. Don't need no traitors in here. I pledged my life to their mother, Captain Stark. I swore to her I'd bring her daughters home. You sure I can't get you a bit more kidney pie? What? It's nothing, my lady. You wouldn't be screwing your face up like that if it was nothing. Oh, don't. <laughs> the Lannisters want Lady Sansa. I don't think we should be telling people we're searching for Lady Sansa. Hmm. You got a point there. My lady. My lord. Could I have a word? What about? Not kidney pie. <laughs> Never met no Sansa Stark. But I know her sister, Arya. No one's seen Arya Stark since her father was beheaded. She's presumed dead. When was that? Heading up north for the Night's Watch. She was all dressed up as a boy, going by the name Ari. The mm. Lannisters took us prisoner. We escaped. And the brother had took us prisoner. They sold me to the innkeep. They were going to sell Arya to her mother at River Run, along with another prisoner. Big ugly fella. Foul mouth and a face like a half burnt ham. The hound. If you find her, could you give her this? You should like the last one I gave her, but this one turned out better. Hmm. Hmm. What looks like that fire on her? You were saying? <laughs> <laughs> you lucky. I mean. We'll take her to the Eerie, my lady. Why the Eerie? Her aunt, Lysa Arryn. She's Arya's last living relative with money. She hates the Lannisters. Lord Tyrion made sure I knew which house married which and who hated who. Sansa could be there too. Aye, my lady. 
Could be. You sure about this? No. Treat my bud. Imagined you'd be back at the brothel at this hour. Cersei approached me. We spoke a great deal about her daughter. How worried your sister is about her. She was trying very hard to pretend she had not come to sway me against you. I think she may have even believed it herself. It was difficult for her to hide her true intentions. She desperately wants to see you killed. It looks as though I've taken care of that myself. Hmm. She's wanted this for a long time. Yes, I know. We met, you and I, many years ago. I think I would have remembered that. Unlikely, you had just been born. Our father brought me and my sister Elia with him on a visit to Casterly Rock. The whole way from dawn, all anyone talked about was the monster that had been born to Tywin Lannister. <laughs> she promised she would show you to us. Then, she and your brother took us to your nursery and she unveiled the freak. He ain't no freak. Large, your arms and legs were a bit small, but no claw, no red eye, no tail between your legs. <laughs> to hide our disappointment, that's not a monster, I told Cersei. That's just a baby. And she said he killed my mother. It doesn't matter, she told us. Everyone says he will die soon. Oh, I want her. She, oh, I want her dear. That's just evil. Cersei always gets what she wants. And what about what I want? Justice. If you want justice, you've come to the wrong place. I mean, what I mean, dude. I've come to the perfect place. What are you gonna do? He can't do nothing. You wrong me to justice, and all those who have wronged me are right here. I will begin with Sir Gregor Clegane. I will be your champion. <laughs> yeah! Now I hope he win now. <laughs> Cause if he don't win, I mean... That was a good prediction you had last episode. Yeah. But he went to him. He didn't, yeah. he didn't have to go to him. I hope he win, God. Please let him win. Good boy. Hello, Robin. Hi there, so pretty. What are you doing? I'm building my home, Winterfell. Does Winterfell have a moon door? No, I'm afraid not. When we get married, you can tell me if you don't like somebody, and then we can bring them back here and whoosh! Boy, mm. crazy. I like the sound of that. Can you touch? Put a moon door in your Winterfell. It can go in here, in this big Be palace. careful! You've ruined it, and I'm going to have to rebuild the whole I thing. I didn't ruin it! You did. I didn't ruin it! Now, do you? <laughs> Ooh! We're going to tear him up. She slept the shit out of him. She's going to tear, he going to tear mother. His mother should have. A long time ago. He telling the truth. Yeah. Instead of putting them on their titty. I mean, me worry about Aunt Lyra. And now you're the. I'll never see it again. A lot can happen between now and never. Why did you really kill Joffrey? Tell me why. Has he killed my. Given the opportunity, what do we do to those who've hurt the ones we love? We kill them. No, I'm saying. <laughs> in a better world, you might have been my child, but we don't live in that world. Auntie, gonna whoop your tail. I'm just saying, slap on her son. You're more beautiful than she ever was. Oh, now you're a vaccination as well now? Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! Yeah, go along. Oh, Lord, that auntie, I could see it now. But she was jealous before anything happened. Mm -hmm. She gonna throw her down the moon. Sky. Whatever. You wanted to see me, Aunt Lysa? Yeah, moon door. Moon sky. Answer. Oh, Lord Jesus. She probably thinks she caught her in about slapping Robin in the face. Yeah, don't get too close. <laughs> I don't know. Do you know how far the fool is? Nah, but we hope you tell us. So you can. <laughs> it's fascinating. 
What happens to bodies when they hit the rocks from such a height? I know. Now, wouldn't it be cold in there? You got that moon or door open? Up and high in the mountains, probably a cool breeze. Robin, I know it. I promise it won't happen. Be coy with me, you little whore. You kissed him. Kiss me, I pulled a wire. <laughs> he is mine! <laughs> My uh, I told you. That's what happens to people who stand between Peter and me. Look down, look down, look down. Lisa! Hmm. Let her go. Hmm. You want her? Yeah, you ugly. Empty-headed. I don't know who. Why we empty? Just like a mother. That's why they had to have them arrange marriages. Why did you bring her here? Why? Let her go, Lisa. Oh. Oh, I'll push her down there myself. <laughs> why you all distraught over there? You know. Oh, my sweet wife. <laughs> Nobody don't want your ugly tail. <laughs> and then you're working with the king. I have only loved one woman, <laughs> only one, my entire life. And ain't you? <laughs> he gonna push her watch, isn't he? No, she he gonna push her. Go down there now. How does it feel? You talk about all that man. That's, I want to go see if her head is in back with every hair on her head. <laughs> it's just playing. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. Oh my God. See, nobody don't want you. Yo, She's John, great. her first husband, right? His name is John, right? Yeah, John Aaron. He, he stayed at the King's Landing. He didn't want to be around oh, she was you. there with him. She was there with them. Yeah, she didn't leave till after she killed him. Oh. <laughs> now Robin is the king. There's a theory that Robin is Peter's son. Yeah. Because he, because you know, the the because the, the, he touched in the head. That needs to frail and weak, and that's oh. how Peter was when he was a kid. But uh -huh. there's. I don't think it's ever been said whether or not he is, but there's a theory that he's Peter's child because you know they they messed around, they yeah. had an affair. Well, I, I like I I do like the Helm and Arya together, and he he let his guard down and told her what really happened to him. Yeah, he thought that. But I wish he could clean that wound out just a little bit. Yeah, turn into kind of like a father figure to her. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Let me see what else happened. Oh, there's oh. O'Brien. O'Brien. O'Brien coming to uh, Tyrion. See, I thought Tyrion would go to him because he asked people, but he went he to thought, Tyrion. He probably thought he went there to fight for a Lannister. Oh my God. Because he hates the Lannister so much, but he wants the mountain. Yeah. Well, is that the guy that was fighting, killing all them people in the mountain? Yeah, that's the mountain. Is the mountain of uh, the Hound's Brook? Yeah. Oh, you know, evil kind. Yeah. It's a different actor that plays in, in this season than the one. The one before, because I'm like, that. Don't, don't the look one like that. Oops, sorry. The one in season one. They, they've had like two or three different actors play mm -hmm. the Hound because season one, when they fought mm -hmm. during the joust, a different actor and then in season two when she was kept at heron hall that real tall dude that time was talking to was a hound oh okay which was a different actor then and then they got this guy who was actually like plays them for the rest of the series oh really yeah. until he or until he dies i'm like until he dies i hope <laughs> i hope o'brien uh, kills him because that won't be a good thing if he die yeah Mm. okay i like it all right everybody if this is your first time go ahead and hit that subscribe button thanks for coming along this journey with us and as always like and comment as until next time bye bye uh.